I'm Paul Bartlett, the Automation and Controls Manager for H2O Innovation. We specialize in water and wastewater treatment systems focused in membrane technology. I'm David Rojas, Chief Automation Engineer of Automation Station. Automation Station offers a wide range of products and services, including SCADA systems, visual management systems like production dashboards, OE and ANDON systems, uh, facility or building management systems, and statistical process control applications. The City of Decatur Wastewater Treatment Plant is the first membrane bioreactor plant in the state of Arkansas. The City of Decatur had two key problems they needed to have solved. The first problem was to increase the size of the plant to accept additional waste from neighboring communities as well as an additional industrial source. The second problem was the antiquated control system. They didn't have data logging, reporting, or trending. Ignition was able to do all three. This ignition application utilized the vision module and communicated to 14,000 tags. It utilized the historian and a custom database along with the reporting module. We worked with H2O Innovation to develop objects in the PLCs and then we tied those over to UDTs which helped simplify the development of the entire application. So even though there was 14,000 tags, we were able to manage them efficiently using those UDTs. My name is James Boston. I am the Chief Operator and Public Works Manager for the City of Decatur, Arkansas. For the last 10 years, we have operated a sequencing batch reactor, an SBR, and we converted it into a membrane bioreactor plant. Now that we have ignition, we can operate the wastewater treatment plant from one central location. I can even operate the wastewater treatment plant from my house on my laptop. We have a complete picture of what is going on at the wastewater treatment plant at all times. It's real-time data, real-time alarms, everything is right on the screen. Ignition's unlimited licensing allowed us to give access to the mayor of Decatur as well as neighboring cities' utility directors. This allows them to make real-time business decisions based on live data. My name is Bob Tharp. I'm the mayor of the city of Decatur, Arkansas. I'm a firm believer in industrial management that you look at data and data coupled with insight insight and data put together drives you to an action process. And so that is a core belief of mine as I uh, provide leadership to the city and to industry. So when we looked at Ignition, that's what we found, a huge amount of data, reliable data, consistent data, and we took our insight, which is our people's time on the job, and then that drove us to good action plans. And that will continue to be our hope and our goal as we continue with Ignition and H2O. Before we upgraded their control systems, the operators were using pen and paper to log all of their data and storing them in file cabinets. Ever since Ignition was installed, they were able to visualize this data and use for trending, reporting, graphing, um, which saves time and money for the customer. One of the things that the city really liked was being able to pull in weather data. We use Ignition to grab real-time weather information from the National Weather Service and plot that information stored in the historian. Using the weather data, the operators can make adjustments to their plant to ensure uh, normal operation during storm conditions. A big reason H2O was selected for this project was our unique Flex MBR design. H2O's Flex MBR allows any membrane manufacturer's product to be used. By adjusting these set points on this page, the control system will seamlessly change between membrane manufacturers. This is a huge impact financially for the city, as they aren't locked into a specific membrane. When the time comes for replacement, the membranes can be shopped around. Lab data that is manually entered into the SCADA system is now available for trending. This allows staff to graphically see data trends that used to go unnoticed. Corrective actions can then be taken before these issues are out of control. A neat aspect of the system is that the operators have the ability to enter in their data, uh, either through an in-house influent data entry, in-house effluent, or even the discharge monitoring report. Here they can enter in information about the lab and identify whether any of the readings are below certain thresholds. They can also enter in discharge limits for the month. And all this data can be viewed in a PDF report fashion and they can print out and send out as needed. The Ignition project connected all of my different control systems into one central network. So now the city has complete control of their plant on multiple screens and they can even access the information remotely. In the past we had to go gather information and we had to put it all together. Now all the information is in one central location. 
I'd just like to thank H2O and their company for bringing uh, the membrane system to, to us, Indicator. This was exactly what my town needed. We are the first membrane uh, plant in the state of Arkansas, and I know that we're going to lead uh, many other cities in the state as we share our success. H2O Innovation was a breath of fresh air to the project. Working with H2O and Automation Station has been a fantastic experience. Thank you.